I think he's slowly moving. Are you slowly moving? Oh, guys, I'm in the middle of Menards and I just jumped like a little girl when this thing popped up. <laughs> Okay guys, today we are over in New Philadelphia at the Menards. This building was just built not too long ago. And guys, I love retail. That's what this channel is mainly about. And if you go back on this channel and look, you can see this place go from being a super Kmart to a Menards, the entire thing being built. But today, we're going in here to see what we can find for Halloween. Apparently I came in the out. <laughs> But we're gonna go find some Halloween stuff in here. Ooh, and I see it straight ahead, guys. Inflatables. It looks like we got some animatronics. Oh my god, I'm getting excited already. Right out the box, we got a giant sea serpent. Look at him, he's like Nessie the Loch Ness Monster. <laughs> okay, maybe not exactly. Oh my god, look, I said he was a sea, sea serpent, and he actually is. And he has fog with him, too. Although, of course, he's not fogging right now. But, it looks like there's a little hole, like, in his mouth there. That must be where the fog comes out. That looks awesome. And here he is, right here. Pumpkin Hollow, air blown with fog effect serpent. That is awesome. Okay, let's see what else we got here. Let's look at the ones that are blown up already first. This is a pretty cool one right here. I like these ones that have a lot of color to them. And that's this one right here, the Witch Cauldron scene. We got a little ghost here. Let's see. Oh, okay. Wow, this is this is one big long one here from the cat all the way down to the skull. That's a pretty cool one. I like that. <laughs> I love those witch legs sticking out the top. <laughs> it's too funny. <laughs> Okay, we got a couple of little ones here. Okay, this guy looks familiar, but I don't know who he is. Maybe he's not anybody specific, because he's just labeled as Inflatable Zombie. And look here, we got Inflatable Reaper, Frankenstein, Witch, Ghost, a Pumpkin Stack. The multicolored uh, Jemmy Pumpkin Stack is one that's really difficult to find. Okay, there's a turkey for Thanksgiving. But here we go. Everybody keeps asking me about Nightmare Before Christmas. Here's a couple of inflatables. Jack Skellington and Sally. Those look pretty cool. Clown with balloons. Oh, look at this. It's like a cemetery scene. And then more pumpkins there. I like that one. A tree scene. Airblown dragon and a giant dragon. Oh, look at this one, guys, <laughs> with the Frankenstein and the little spider. There was an artist has some books out called Ed Emberley, uh, Ed Emberley's big purple drawing book and big green, big orange drawing book. And with that, uh, that's what reminds me right there, that style. We used to get those books from the library when I was a little kid. And we'd sit around trying to draw those things all day long. Ed Emberley, I'll never forget that name. Scarecrow, a skeleton raptor. That is funny, and he's even got the candy bag. <laughs> a ghost family. I got a bunch of stuff in here. A bunch of stuff over here. We'll go look at that uh, in a minute, but I want to look at the inflatable still till we're done. There, there's the skeleton raptor up there, guys, with his candy bag. That is too funny. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, and I hear this witch over here. Okay, must be uh, motion activated. How do we? Oh, ah, there I we go. Oh my god, she talks forever. Okay, this one here is called the Creepy Caretaker. I haven't heard him working though in any way, and I don't know. Hmm, he's not moving. I'll try to figure him out, but look at this. 
we got a uh, like a fabric what do you call it coffin and I was looking around for that because I thought maybe it went with the creepy caretaker but then I found it down here okay here's the creepy caretaker all alone apparently he rises from behind the grave so he must not be set up right but look collapsible coffin this is 20 bucks <laughs> it's a fabric coffin like nylon big enough for somebody to get in pretty cool these witches just any move you make they start up <laughs> that's one of the best ones I've seen because it actually moves and talks for the longest time Anyway, I was messing with this guy trying to get him going He's got a switch back here. But he must have a short or something because I can't get him to work. Apparently he's supposed to rise up from behind the uh, the headstone there. But we got this witch here. I'd love to see this one working too. I don't understand why these places don't make sure these things work. I'm such an idiot. I'm over here like looking up the witch's skirt trying to find a button <laughs> perv of menards <laughs> we got some other things down here three pack of witch steaks apparently their faces light up color changing lead lights hmm same thing here with the ghosts and look at this we got a big plush zero zero is the best man look at this little pumpkin how much is that guy crap he's falling off I don't even know how much he is, but he's awesome. He's made by Jemmy, too. We got Mickey and Minnie down here. Look at this, guys. We have uh, Nightmare Before Christmas character pumpkins. Jack Skellington. I think, yeah, I saw this one at Party City the other day. You push the button and he lights up. Of course, I'm sure somehow you just flip the switch and he lights up otherwise. But I haven't seen the Sally one. And I especially haven't seen this one, the Oogie Boogie. Yeah. <laughs> That's really cool. I don't know. Oh, okay, these are $15 a piece, apparently. Yeah. Those are really cool. Missed a couple of things down here. Well, here's the Flying Witch. Here's the Looming Phantom. He's not set up. And apparently at one time... They had, or they're going to have, a life-size animated Jack Skellington up. But if they... I don't see him anywhere. So maybe they sold out of him already or something. Here's a couple of blow molds. People love these things. They go nuts for them on eBay. Oh, jeez. Tearing down the house. Oh, my God. I touched one, and they all toppled like I was bowling. Okay, then we got a couple other things here. Turtles candy bowl. Looks like they're all Michelangelo. Superman. Grim Reaper. I think that is all for those. Yeah. And then we got like some of this stuff here. This is like the basic kind of stuff you pretty much see a little bit of everywhere. I like the crow. <laughs> I like those colors. We got mini hay bales over here. Solar landscape uh, skulls. That's pretty cool. What the heck is this? Light up bats and moon. Try me, okay. Ooh, spooky. Okay, a couple of hanging these guys. I like the try me buttons. He's not working. Apparently his eyes light up though. Excuse me, I'm sorry. Oh, look, we got another one here. Animated hanging surprise scarecrow. That's like the ones we see in Spirit. Skeleton bag of bones. And here's more Nightmare Before Christmas. This stuff is everywhere, man. I mean, it's different stuff everywhere you look, but there's Nightmare Before Christmas everywhere. And we got... Maleficent, I believe her name is. Ooh, we got some more of the candy bowls. Darth Maul, Boba Fett, a Jawa, <laughs> Captain America, Wolverine, a ghost. 
more Star Wars up there. I don't know what kind of stuff that is up there. Little miniatures or something. Oh yeah, because we got a whole miniature town here. Oh my god! That is so cool. Spooky town. It's a whole miniature Halloween town. Some of them even make sounds. The candy corner. Ooh, it's, it's a pumpkin trailer. <laughs> That's hilarious. Spooky farm pumpkins, hayride. Look at this, coming out of the well. Witches flying around the top of this one. Spooky town water tower with a spooky tree behind it and pumpkins. Horror hot dogs. <laughs> These things are so small it's kind of difficult for this to zoom in on them good. I mean, you know, and be clear. Then we got these making noises back here. Look, they got a whole dance going on. And the Braveyard Party here in the front. Oh my god, jack-o'-lantern hoppers. How does this work? Whoa! I figured it out. You gotta push it down like this, and then in a minute it will pop up. Watch this. At least I think that's what it's gonna do. Come on, Mr. Pumpkey. We're waiting for you to hop. I think he's slowly moving. Are you slowly moving? Oh, guys, I'm in the middle of Menards and I just jumped like a little girl when this thing popped up. <laughs> okay, I'm curious about this. Pumpkin Masters create a floating skull. Skull cutout. Ooh, okay, it's got a wire from the back, and it hangs it over top, and that's what it looks like when the light is coming out of the pumpkin onto uh, the skeleton's face. That's pretty cool. That's a pretty good idea. I like that. I want to see that in action. All right, guys, we're going to go down here and look at the Halloween candy a minute. It's apparently, it's in a different part of the store. Why? I don't know. <laughs> okay, yeah, here we go. Bags of Halloween candy. Oh my gosh, are these so good or what? 100 grand bars. Look at all of this. I love Halloween candy. And I love when they decorate it like this. 100 pieces with the bat. Mmm. Crunch bars, Butterfingers, Skittles. I never was quite for this kind of stuff in my Halloween basket. <laughs> I wanted the chocolate bars. Here you go. Snickers, M&M's. That's what I wanted. Um, is there anything more? That can't be it. Ah, here we go. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of stuff down here. Look at this, candy corns. I love candy corns. Some people hate them, but I love them. All kinds of stuff. Nerds. Smarties. Nerds are good, and I like Smarties, but... Okay, this is what I hated. I don't know anybody who loves dum-dums in their Halloween basket. If I go trick-or-treating, wait a minute, when I go trick-or-treating, <laughs> I want the candy bars. I want Kit Kats and Reese's and Hershey's and Heath, Milk Duds and Whoppers. All kinds of stuff out here. Look at these giant bags, man. Huge bags of candy. I just buy a whole bag and just close up the, oh my gosh, close up the house. Reesey Outrageous. I haven't even seen these for the longest time, let alone the ones that have Reesey Pieces in them. That looks so delicious. Why do I have to be on a diet? <laughs> Reesey's Take 5. Oh, these things are the bomb. So good. Salted Nut Rolls. Those are like paydays. Okay, what else we got here? Eh, that's not Halloween. That's not Halloween, but it's delicious. Ten, ten packs of Oreos. Yeah, I think this is just more of what we just looked at. Peanut butter Snickers. Yum. There is so much yum in this aisle. <laughs> Guys, child's play. We even got Chucky here for Halloween. All right, I think that's pretty much it, except for a couple of inflatables and things I can see up the front here. We'll look at quick before we go.
some of these things set up at the top here inflatables and I saw a where did I see the dragon hold on we gotta go down here somewhere down here somewhere over the rainbow where in the heck is he oh okay I saw his head hold on right down here there he is there's the giant what do you call him uh, dragon that's pretty cool, actually. Look at him moving his arms, or his arms. Look at him moving his wings. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. All right, guys, that's it. Halloween at Menards. Some pretty cool stuff. I'm out of here. Make sure you subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and hit that bell so you get the notifications, and I will see you guys later. Peace.